Hi there, GoodGolf here. In my last video on pathfinding on a Gaia terrain, I mentioned Megasplat tessellation and the potential issue it can create when objects sink into the terrain. I created this short video on how to make this work properly. So as you can see on the screen, I added Megasplat to the equation. I enabled tessellation with these settings. The tessellation settings are the same as the ones in the Megasplat terrain tessellation example scene. If I now run the project, you will see the knight sink into the terrain. This is due to the difference between the physics collider and the GPU enforced tessellation. So let's stop the project and look how you can resolve this. It's pretty easy if you follow the same route as Jason did in his example scene. First you will need to add the Megasplat collision info script to the terrain. Don't forget to add the texture list and enable two layer if you have that setting enabled on the shader. Next we go to the night. Just add the tessellation physics floor script to it and that's it. This script will use the collision info script the physics data stored in the texture arrays and will offset the night with the tessellation difference. So let's run the project. As you can see it now positions the night on top of the terrain. Okay, that's it for now. If you found this video helpful, then please vote it up.